Uh, I lost him then. Kappa Wing, what's your status? Over. Kappa Wing, this is Allied Command. Please respond. Iota Wing, investigate Kappa's last waypoint. The ionized field is interfering with our transmission. Hmm. Well, don't seem to be much happening at the moment, but I'm sure something will happen in a moment. And uh, all hell will break loose, no doubt. Um, but until that point, we will carry on following Zeta 1 and um, see what happens. Um, I'm already, I've got rockets and tempests, so not too bad. I've got the subtech, I've got the uh, subtech HL7, which is a nice. I'm picking up weapon. something on sensors. I can't get a lock. Aha, uh -huh. something coming up. Oh, hello. I see a red mark up. Hostile right. targets confirmed. A wing of manacores closing fast. Manacores. Pilots, destroy those fighters and stay alert. Watch for a flanking maneuver. No problem, command. We'll take them down. Aha, uh -huh. right, a manacore. I found one. Now, where are you? I can see him. I can hear him, but I can't see him. That's one down. All bandits are down, command. Area right. secure. Resume your patrol, pilots. I've got to find Zeta one. Don't stray too far off of one, or you might lose me in this soup. There's got to be a base or ore destroyer in this nebula somewhere. Those fighters couldn't survive out here on their own. This nebula could be 10 or 20 light years in diameter. Finding a single ship would be impossible. There we go. Unless the Sheevans find us first. Do we have a status update on Kappa Wing? Check your formation, Alpha One. Negative. No word from Kappa yet. We'll find out in debriefing. Come on, I don't seem to be moving with these. Hostile indicators on radar. I can't see any. Oh, now I can. Let's see what we got. There they are. Whoa, he's coming to get me. You son of a bitch. And I'm going to get you first. Whoa, there you are. That's not even the one I'm targeting on. Quick. Oh, there it is. There he is. It's miles away. Whoa, come on. Keep my distance from that one. Whoa, there he is. Oh, hello. Uh, push him. Match time. On your tail. I know. I know. No! away from me. I'm after you and I'm gonna have you. I don't know what these ones are, but they're not doing the right job. I'm gonna go for Tempest. Let's find them first and then we'll fire Tempest out on them. No. Oh, come on. Why am I supposed to get these buggers? They're not as fast as the Mowers I had earlier. But they're still quite hard to pin down. Oh yes, got him. Let's find another one. Is there any more? No, back to Zeta 1. Where are you? Whoa, there you are. Okay, let's get back on patrol. Alpha, Alpha speed. follow my lead. Whoa, I'm following your lead. I'm matching your speed. I'm right behind you. Whoa, we lost one. We lost one wingman already. That just leaves me and him. Let's keep going. Follow him. Let's see where we end up. 
hopefully not against too many <coughs> excuse me I've got a bit of a cough today um, but I'll try my best to um, keep that at bay while I play well it rhymes keep it at bay while I play yeah it rhymes well done okay what's going to happen oh it's a flashing I can see some red light somewhere the center of the screen so better keep an eye out for that there's something up coming up oh I destroyed it whatever it was never said anything to me come on how much of this ionized weather have we got to put up with I don't remember doing this um, mission Hold on. before. I so. got a visual on something big. A cruiser or a corvette. Do you recognize the configuration? Is it a Rakshasa or a Kane? Negative command, it's a Terran cruiser, Fenris class. There's no Allied ship authorized in your vicinity. Hail them, pilot. This is Zeta Wing of the 107th Ravens, GTD Aquitaine. Please identify yourself. This is Captain Arthur Romig of the GTC Trinity. We have sustained heavy damage and our jump drive is inoperative. We need immediate assistance. Your designation is incorrect, Romig. Your ship defected to the NTF 10 days ago. You have been stripped of your rank and citizenship in the GTVA. Surrender the Trinity or be destroyed. As Captain of the NTC Trinity, I surrender on the condition you get us the hell out of here. What's your status? We repelled a Shivan attack, but engines sustained critical damage. I powered down non-essential systems so the Shivans wouldn't detect us. We've been drifting ever since. What's your assessment of the damage? Some components were destroyed in the attack, but my chief engineer thinks a field repair is possible. We will send a damage control team with the necessary components. Transmit your diagnostics. Transmitting now. What were you doing out here, Romic? As a prisoner of war, my rights are protected under the Beta Aquilae Convention. I will answer no questions, Command. I thought Rebels didn't recognize Baytac. No, but we do, Pilot. Damage control has been deployed. They should be arriving momentarily. Well, I'm glad they know where they're going. Discovery I'm... here. Initiating docking procedure. Watch our backs, little friends. Mm. Oh, Heads yeah. Up. Enemy Heads wing up. closing in. Target, 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 target. There's one. I'm breaking off. I'm going after. Oh, I missed him. Whoa. Matching speed. Hopefully. Where is he? Come on. speed and still getting away from me. Prepare to be boarded, Trinity. Trinity's oh, yes. by. He's down. Any more? No, back to Zeta One. Where's Zeta One? Um yeah, Zeta One, where are you? Docking point secure. There okay, you are. Romic, we're taking you and your crew into custody. Follow the drill and no one gets hurt. Here we go. Back to Zeta 1. Keep in line with him. He's flattening all over the place. So I don't know what he's doing. More hostiles incoming. More hostiles incoming, okay. Keep the Shivans away from the Trinity pilots. That ship won't survive another attack. Give okay. us a time estimate, Discovery. We can jury rig a solution in 15 minutes, Command. It's too far away. Give me another one that's nearer. Can you bring the anti-fighter turrets online? Negative. We need all power on engines. Bandit on your tail. Hmm. It would be, wouldn't it? Right. Uh, find it. Where are you? Oh, 
to the map. Come on. How come just keep other players and shoot these buggers down and I can't? Match speed. We've lost the Trinity. All wings return to base. We're avoiding this mission. <coughs> 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 Return to base. Nah, we didn't do it. They got mullered. Oh, they got taken. So that failed us the mission. Well, that weren't much chance we escaped in that. Wasn't you confronted it? an overwhelming Shivan force in a hostile environment. Under these circumstances, there was nothing you or anyone else could have done to save the Trinity and our boarding party. All right. You were lucky to survive this sortie, pilot. We have heard nothing from Kappa Wings since they vanished from our sensors. Unfortunately, we must presume the worst. They will be listed MIA unless we find evidence to the contrary. Our search parties have found no trace of these fighters. The presence of the Trinity deepens the enigma of the NTF's secret agenda. What was the Trinity doing out here? And what does Bosch know about the subspace portal? All patrols have uncovered an extensive Sheevan force in the nebula. Command will deploy more warships through the subspace portal to assist with our mission of exploration and containment. IOTA and Epsilon wings encountered two Sheevan cruisers near our current location. When our reinforcements arrive, we will move against them. Right. So it didn't... Didn't, um... Say that, um... So what recommendations are. No, no recommendations, so we just accept that. Yep, there's not much we could do about that, apparently. So, there you go. We did our best, and I took a few ships out in the way, in its wake, so... 32 years ago, on the Altair system, Vesudan scientists discovered the remnants of an extinct civilization we now call the Ancients. And here we found the secret to defeating the Shivans. How close did we come to being a footnote in the history of a future species that would happen upon our ruins 10,000 years from now? Would they indulge in the fiction of their own immortality until the Shivans came for them? And how long had this gone on? Did the ancients stumble upon the monoliths and the tombs of their predecessors in this distant corner of space, dismissing the warnings carved in the walls of the sepulchre? And when the destroyers came at last, what did the ancients think as they sifted the cremation of dust and bones, staring into the mute remains for a key? Some solution to their plight. What if there had been countless races, stretching back into infinity? And like the nine cities of Troy, each civilization had been built on the rubble of one that came before. Each annihilated by the Shivans. The ancients died 8,000 years ago. As humanity emerged from its Neolithic infancy, they believed their voyage across the sea of stars woke the dragon that slept beneath the waves. That the Shivans were birthed from the flux of subspace and their destruction was the revenge of an angry cosmos. Mm. With recent victories on the Civil War front, the GTVA Security Council has authorized the deployment of two Dimos-class corvettes into the nebular theater of operations. The Lysander and the Actium crossed the subspace portal in Gamma Draconis at 2335 hours and joined up with the Aquitaine's battle group. On their last sortie, Epsilon and Iota wings encountered two Shivan warships, a Rakshasa-class cruiser designated the Iblis, and a Lilith-class cruiser designated the Azurus. Admiral Petrock has instructed our corvettes to hunt down and destroy these vessels. The 107th will provide fighter cover. Oh, fighter cover, eh? Ooh. Alpha Wing, your mission is to escort the Lysander and the Actium as they carry out this assault. Your first priority will be to eliminate all hostile fighters and bombers. Only then will you assist the corvettes with their strike against the Shivan warships. If we lose either corvette, you will abort the mission and withdraw from the field immediately. Hmm. So. Protect it and then destroy the two ships. Okay, well, 
I'll get around to that in a little while. I'm just going to take a break now and uh, be right back. <laughs> 